is up guys welcome back to this is episode number six today I'm gonna be doing a flex test with the help of my father but first let's get in the Jeep what the this isn't my Jeep this is a sticky porta potty that didn't work let me try again Hey, we got it. Let's go. It's about time. Um, so let's get back into the video. So if you guys can see, I got a little bit to clean up before I can get the Jeep out of the garage. So I'm going to take you guys along. <laughs> So test number one is going to be a 6x6 six six block, um, and this is with the sway bars connected. So this is a 6x6 six six block, none aired down, just I put in four low and locked the hubs. Oh, the sway bar is connected. It's not really anything much, but... That was test number one. Didn't do much, but... You can see... It's up off the ground. Um, I am going to disconnect the sway bars to do it too, but I'm going to do the few tests without them, without them disconnected first, so, yep. So, this is test number two. It looks, it's actually a bit higher than it looks, um, but as you can see, we're flexing. Looking good. Still no tires off the ground. So, to the next test. So it may be a little hard to see, but I got about probably 12 to 14 inches right here of flex. No problems. Sway bar still connected. Okay, so 
after further inspection, um, you can see it's it's gotta be 14, 15 inches. Doesn't look like it on camera, but let's see if I can get back far enough where it does. It is a pretty good um, representation, of, but that's about what I realized is is that so it's it's flexing pretty good, um, and this tire is just a like just barely on the garage ground, so that's our max flex with the sway bars. Um, now over the weekend. Or tomorrow or something, I might have a chance. Well, I, I'll have a chance if you want to see. I'll disconnect the sway bars and do um, a flex test. So drop a comment down below or like this video, whatever. That'll show me to do. I'll disconnect the sway bars and do another flex test. But this is about all the flex I get. But it's pretty good. I'm happy with it so yeah so guys I hope you enjoyed that flex test with the sway bars connected um, they're still connected I just put it in four low and locked the hubs um, and it worked fine we did the six by six block and then that little berm thing I had there and the berm maxed it out pretty much for them being connected but soon hopefully I will be disconnecting them and doing another test, so that should be fun, but I hope you enjoy this video. Make sure you comment down below your opinions, what you've noticed. Uh, make sure you drop a like this video. It really helps the channel. Um, subscribe if you haven't already because you will not want to miss the build that I do of my 1994 Jeep YJ. It should be really fun. And turn on the bell so you get notified every time I post.